Over 80% of men live for 10 or more years after a diagnosis of prostate cancer. I've come to Cambridge University Hospital to speak with Dr Vincent Nana Prakasam about some of the treatments that are available for this type of cancer. So Vincent, what are the most important factors when deciding what type of treatment a person should have? The treatment options for prostate cancer are very much dependent on what kind of cancer an individual has and also the patient themselves. So if a cancer is confined to within the prostate gland, uh, then we might be able to treat it by surgery or radiotherapy. Uh, but equally, sometimes there might be a very slow-growing tumour, in which case we can just keep an eye on that. But the kind of cancer is determined uh, by the size of it or the stage of a cancer, the type of cancer it is or the grade, and also the PSA test. And we use those three put together to create an idea of the risk of a particular individual dying of prostate cancer. What treatments are available? In general, there is surgery to remove the prostate gland, radiotherapy where you deliver high-intensity radiation beams, or surveillance where we can monitor and just check on someone and defer treatment till later. So a number of different options then, Vincent. How do you decide which one's best? That decision is left to the patient in consultation with his consultant or nurse specialist uh, and comes down to whether the patient feels uh, that a particular type of treatment is best suited for their lifestyle and also the risks and side effects which may come about from that. And what happens when treatment's finished? After treatment's finished, uh, the patient enters a phase of very close monitoring and where they'll be seen regularly in the hospital, often with a PSA test measurement being done uh, on a regular interval. What about treatment for cancers that have spread? When a cancer is spread beyond the prostate, then the most common treatment is hormone therapy, and that serves to keep the, co uh, the cancer under control. And uh, many men can live for many years with that. And if that should fail, there are actually uh, other drugs which can be used, chemotherapies, uh, which again can be very effective. Dealing with cancer is never easy, and this is especially so when deciding about treatments. But of course it helps if you know the facts. If you or anyone you know has been diagnosed with prostate cancer and you'd like further information, visit the Cancer Research UK website or see the other videos in this series.